come quiet. The Sanhedrin ruling council of Israel is now in session. KFS Most High Priest presiding. Revered members, you all know why this special meeting has been called. Ever since the apparent healing of the crippled man at Bethsaida, the man Jesus from Nazareth has been going throughout the land disobeying the laws of the temple services and attempting to bring disgrace and dishonor to the rulers and priests of Israel, to us. When enough people are on his side, he will lead them into a revolt and place himself on a throne as their king. This we must stop. Ever since Bethsaida, has not this august body been trying to entrap Jesus so as to have him killed? Nicodemus, you are always speaking out of turn. I think the question posed by Nicodemus is appropriate and should be answered. The answer is, uh, uh, yes, we have. Why, sir? I told you why, to put an end to his teachings of heresy before he overthrows all that God and Rome have ordained. You have had spies out all this time, have you not? Watching every move and listening to his every word? Uh, yes. And still you have found nothing to warrant his arrest? <laughs> Captain? Yes, sir. Our spies report that Jesus of Nazareth is such... Uh, well, he speaks with so much authority and wisdom that they become transfixed, unable to move against him. Also, they fear the people. Any open move against Jesus might easily arouse the wrath of the multitudes and the lives of the spies would be endangered. Now, does that answer your question, Nicodemus? For the time being, yes. I've come to a conclusion, members of the council. Obviously, Jesus cannot be taken into custody in the presence of a multitude of people unless he can be led into a trap that will reveal to the multitude that he is a false teacher seeking to overthrow the government as well as the ceremonies appointed by God. If that fails, we will have to resort to arresting him privately and whisking him away to a secret place. And there... Uh, well, all, all in favor, so indicate. Uh, Nicodemus, you did not vote. Neither did you, Joseph of Arimathea. I have not Hold as I yet made up my mind. At the proper time. Captain, you continue to have all places covered by our spies. Remember, all of you, I want Jesus trapped so he can be silenced. Above all, he must be humbled before the multitude so that we, once more, become the revered leaders of the people. The very first thing I want you to do when you see Jesus the first day of the next feast, if possible, is to ask him this question. Ask it so that all may hear. It is the law that all teachers in Israel must study at the feet of priests in the temple. This you have never done. So tell us. So tell us. You, you are, are a man, man of, of no learning. learning. Therefore, Therefore, by, by what, what authority, authority do you, do you presume, presume to go about Israel teaching the people? My doctrine is not mine, but his that sent me. If any man will do his will, he shall know the doctrine whether it be of God or whether I speak of myself. The master speaks simply, yet with great meaning and wisdom. Truth must be received into the soul. Then it will claim the doing of God's will. Sometimes, Peter, you're as deep as still water. Shh. He that speaketh of himself seeketh his own glory. But he that seeketh his glory that sent him, the same is true, and no unrighteousness is in him. True, very true. Shh. Did not Moses give you the law, thou shalt not kill? Yet none of you keepeth it. If so, why go ye about to kill me? Thou hast a devil. Who goest about to kill thee? It is the rulers and the Pharisees who seek to kill Jesus. He speaks boldly, yet those who were sent to arrest him say nothing. They do not know that he is the very Christ whom they seek. Stranger, I heard your words. You marvel. We all do. Jesus is from Nazareth. Grew up there. People know him. But when Christ cometh, no man knoweth whence he is. Shh! He's going to speak again. Ye do know me, and ye know from whence I came. I am not come of myself, but he that sent me is true, whom ye know not. But I know him... For I am from him, and he hath sent me. He openly claimed to be sent of God. Yes, sir. Captain? Yes, sir. Take some officers. Go to the temple. Find Jesus, arrest him, and bring him here to me. At once, sir. <laughs> He is. 
go and... Oh, no. No, he's about to talk to the people. Let's hear what he has to say. Yet a little while am I with you, and then I go unto him that sent me. Ye shall seek me and shall not find me, and where I am, thither ye cannot come. I go to him that sent me. Me. What does he mean by that? I wonder, could he... You did not arrest Jesus. No, sir. Why? Never spake man like this man. Never spake man like... What kind of an excuse is that? Jesus spake with much authority and power. Are you deceived like the people? Have any of the rulers or Pharisees believed on him? Have any of us? Some, sir. Only the people believe, but they are ignorant of the laws and are cursed. Take your men back to the temple, and this time bring Jesus to me. We have enough evidence to put him to death. Sir, does our law permit the judging of any man without first hearing his case in court? Nay, so also shall the man from Nazareth be heard, that we may know the truth about what he doeth. He shall be judged accordingly. Uh, uh, the court of the Sanhedrin is dismissed.